This is an ultrasound clip demonstrating a positive spine sign in the setting of a pleural effusion. A phased array probe is used as delineated by the shape of the footprint at the top of the screen. Based on the structures we are seeing in this image, the probe is placed in a coronal orientation on the lateral aspect of the patient's right chest wall, just anterior to the mid-axillary line with the probe indicator directed towards the patient's head. Let's look at some important anatomy from superficial to deep. At the top of the screen, we can identify our liver here, as well as a hyperechoic diaphragm seen here. This anechoic space here is pleural fluid, and the spine is seen in the far field of this image as a hyperechoic longitudinal structure. Lastly, we can see a structure moving in and out of the left side of the screen, which is our lung base. Now let's focus in on the spine. In a normally aerated lung, the spine should not be able to be visualized past the beginning of the diaphragm. That's because ultrasound waves cannot travel through air and are scattered, preventing imaging of any deeper structures. However, in the case of a pleural fusion, a medium has now been created for ultrasound to travel through, allowing visualization of the spine deep to the thoracic cavity. This is known as a spine sign and is diagnostic of a pleural effusion.